Star Wars fans do not have to wait until 2019 and to buy a ticket to see the new Star Wars Disney Parks attraction because it is technically in downtown Disney and therefore you don't have to buy a park ticket. Um, this will be somewhat of a VR experience, but I would say an elevated VR experience because there will also be physical locations involved. It's called Star Wars Secrets of the Empire and it is a Project made in collaboration between The Void, Lucasfilm, and ILM's interactive division. Um, and they've made other previous, well, Vo The Void has made previous attractions called Ghostbusters Dimensions. Um, and this looks to be interesting because it will feature a VR experience with things that you can touch, uh, see, interact with. And this is kind of a unique touch to it. Visitors will walk through a physical stage and sets with the virtual world mapped on top of it thanks to a customized head mounted display, haptic vest, and backpack computer. So like the scene at Big Market in Valerian, but more compelling and definitely more interactive because you will actually be there. So there will be virtual walls that you could touch, virtual chairs that you can actually sit down in, um, and then maybe there will be things in the air around you or the atmosphere around you like smells and mists and cold area, dark area, not dark, hot area. And I think we're definitely going to see a lot of heat in this area because while we don't know that much about this experience, we do have a picture for it. Yeah, it's going to be warm. I think that was a pretty easy <laughs> guess. So this looks to be Mustafar um, with Darth Vader's, I don't wanna call it a castle structure <laughs> from Rogue One off in the distance. There are stormtroopers engaged in a firefight, some kind of droid that seems to be giving out instructions. And then two participants who seem to be wearing stormtrooper armor themselves. So perhaps this will take a similar note as Galaxy's Edge where you would be able to be on one side or the other or maybe maybe some crossover in between. There's a little bit of gray area. It does appear that you will be equipped with blaster rifles and the helmet will, it seems to look more like uh, it fits in this world rather than a standard VR helmet. So that is a great touch. Star Wars Secrets of the Empire will be coming out in this year's holiday season. So uh, December of 2017, which is far ahead of vague time in 2019. It will also probably be out around the time of Star Wars The Last Jedi. So expect some hype around that or perhaps bleeding over into that. Uh, I think it looks awesome. I don't know how much it will cost at all. I know very little about it. I still think it looks great. And I do want to be in that virtual reality interactive experience uh, to be able to touch and experience it all. I like this so much better than just watching a film strip in the former Captain EO theater or whatever preview theater there is because there is that level of interactivity and using VR in a really creative way. I think this is, I mean, the reason why I like video games is that it's a more active storytelling experience and this is just taking an even more active step. Audience, will you go to it? Will you shell out whatever money it takes? Please let me know below and please like and subscribe for more.